this ancient woodland not far from Windsor um, near a village called Raysbury. Now I knew about the Magna Carta but I didn't know that one of the stories that it was signed under this ancient yew tree. Um, this tree is still there now and it was uh, it's 2,000 years old so back then it was already a thousand years old. So that was my starting point, 12.15. I wanted the uh, the suite to move through time though, so, um, and to signpost certain landmarks that I thought were important along the way, important in, in the sense of um, the, the, the pursuit of liberty and freedom. Um, but equally I wanted to tie in these sort of landmarks with um, the harmony of the day. So uh, there's an influence there of um, early church music, there's some Baroque, there's some um, old English sort of jig like um, or Celtic um, sort of, sort of uh, folk music and then there's more um, romantic classical influence let's say Chopin and then it comes to the 20th century and I, I borrow, borrow some music of Scriabin some of his harmonic ideas um, and then um, it, f it finally finishes with a kind of um, hypnotic trans like groove. So it's like a round trip of eight hundred years. Um, and it's um it's 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 an emotional journey through lots of different moods and I um tell you what I couldn't have chosen two better guys in the band to, to bring out all these different colours. So Asaf Circus drums and Yuri Golubev bass and I in between them. The, the, the sheer musicality, the sheer um, just uh, beauty of, of the sound that they produce and also they, the attention to details. So we could have all these different moods within the suite uh, within three instruments and it was uh, it was a fantastic experience of two days in a fantastic studio called Master Chord Studios. The spoken word section of the album by Neil Sparks uh, becomes the climax of the album. Now within two tracks he was able to um, tell this whole journey from you know, King John signing the Magna Carta under the yew tree to the discovery of the new world, and you know, the Magna Carta being the um, bedrock of the American Constitution. But he was able to get to the heart of this whole journey. Um, so um, we have his his words um, on on the album. They be, they become the liner notes. So I'm very happy with this album and all that's, all the people involved. Life. Yeah. 